Hey guys, it's Naomi. It is a beautiful summer day here in Indiana, and so I thought I would do today's video outside, um, providing that Jerome cooperates. I already had to pull him out of the swimming pool because he just was not having any of me being on the laptop while he was in the pool. So um, he is sitting beside me playing, so hopefully this will work out okay. I just wanted to share um, our story a little bit, uh, especially for the newer people in the group. Just give them a chance to kind of hear how Sam and I came to learn about Young Living and how we ended up making it a business. So um, I actually was introduced to Kim Prather in 2012 via a um, childhood friend on Facebook and uh, because we were both interested in adopting. And so I became friends with Kim and she was using Young Living um, and had been sharing and it piqued my interest because I had used essential oils um, and not actually had real results with them. I was using fragrant oils so you couldn't use them on your skin um, and then I had used health food store oils which also really didn't give me any real results and then I had tried other a couple other brands um, without actually getting results and even having a reaction to one. So I was actually at that point pretty skeptical about essential oils actually working. Um, and I talked to Kim for a year and the product that initially piqued my interest really was actually Progestins Plus, which I need to post a photo of my Progestins um, empties at some point because it is the one product I have never run out of and um, have steadily purchased it for the four year, four, over four years that I've been with Young Living. So we talked to her for about a year before we used a tax refund check to get a kit. And my husband actually, Sam was um, initially dragging his feet because when he met me, I had been selling Avon and I used the term selling very loosely because I wasn't actually making any money. <laughs> so his concern with network marketing was that um, he didn't want me to do it because he didn't think it would be a good investment. And I was like, honey, I have no interest in selling. Um, I really just want these oils. I want to give them a try. And I want to try the Progestins, which um, is uniquely exclusive to Young Living. You cannot get Progestins anywhere else. And um, so to get Progestins, I would have had to be a Young Living member anyway. So finally, we got a tax refund. You're fine. You're fine. There you go. Got a tax refund check. Got a kit. The kit was, I believe, 150 at the time. And um, you only got like eight oils. And you didn't even get a diffuser. You got like a, a coupon for $50 off a diffuser or something like that, which I didn't even use. So I didn't even get a diffuser. Yes, thank you. That's nice. Um, and we actually didn't even start using our oils right away because we experienced um, some loss in our lives. We, uh, my best friend passed away shortly after I got my kit um, from an accidental prescription drug overdose. Um, so these were actually medications he'd been given by a doctor um, at the age of 27. And then three weeks later, um, two, Sam's two youngest sisters were killed in a um, car crash involving two semis. Um, and our lives just kind of stopped. Um, up until that point, we actually had a thriving wedding photography business and really didn't need Young Living um, financially. And I had been struggling with some health issues, which is why I was interested in oils, but I had been told that I, wouldn't, I would never have children. Um, and my ultimate dream of being a stay-at-home mom just was never gonna happen unless we adopted. So we were hoping eventually maybe our photography business would become successful enough that we could uh, use it to support an adoption, but um, we really just were kind of treading water financially. <laughs> yes, I know. <laughs> um, so we'll fast forward a little bit to the fall after the accident happened, which would be in 2013. And I think that, I mean, my health was starting to improve some with using oils. I was really just using them um, to tackle issues after they happened. I wasn't looking at them um, as integrating them daily. Um, and when I started doing that uh, and I started to get Sam on board, um, 
we noticed some improvements in our lives. And when he started using Joy Daily to help him um, with just the aftermath of emotions following um, you know, his two sisters passing away, uh, we just realized that not only did we not want to be without these oils, but we wanted to start sharing them. Well, when I started sharing them, I earned an accidental paycheck. And the really cool thing about the accidental paycheck, um, I didn't know it was coming. It came in the mail. Hey, if you don't like that, don't crawl on the grass. Jerome, here. <laughs> the grass touches my arms and it hurts. Well, don't crawl on the grass then. Um, so I came home and the Sam handed me an envelope and he goes, Hey, you got something in the mail from Young Living? And I said, Oh, what is it? And he said, it looks like a check. And I opened it up and I said, Oh my gosh, it is a check. Not only was it a check, but it was a check for almost the exact amount that our checking account was going to be overdrawn. So as we're racing to the bank to put it in our checking account, Sam says, I really think you need to learn more about this. And that was the moment when he really got on board with Young Living. Uh, he actually had a legitimate interest in um, it being a business. And so we were both using the products. And so I enlisted uh, my leader's help, which would be Katrina. Some of you guys see her posting in this group. Um, so Katrina started to help me and um, we went pretty quickly from star to senior star um, and then push for executive when we hit executive we wanted really badly to make silver and six and you guys those of you who were on our team at the time know that like we were really pushing for silver and six which just means you reach silver from executive in six months and young living rewards you for that and uh, our team was so awesome and really rose to the challenge and so in october of 2015 so we joined Young Living in April, I'm sorry, 2014. We joined Young Living in April of 2013. October of 2014, we made silver in six and we remained silver. So we earned the free trip to Silver Retreat as well. So we're currently pushing for gold right now. Um, and one of the um, really cool things is that um, one of my early goals was that I wanted Young Living to um, be able to send me home and so that I could I could be home and work from home and hopefully we would adopt children. Um, and as we worked on our health goals and we started to target um, fertility as one of our health goals, um, we found out in, so let's see, that was October of 2015 that I was pregnant. <laughs> And surprise, I mean, it wasn't a surprise because we were, we'd been hoping and praying and working very hard for it to happen, but to actually finally see um, that positive pregnancy test was huge. Um, and Sam was like, uh, take another test because <laughs> he didn't, he didn't believe it at first, but I knew. Um, and so, um, at that point, I had just quit one of my part-time jobs, and uh, two weeks before Jerome came, I quit my second part-time job. Uh, I was actually work earning more through Young Living than both of those jobs, so in a way, we didn't need them. Uh, making the transition was hard, though, because, you know, I was earning twice, double what I am now because I quit both those jobs, but I also get to work exclusively from home, do videos outdoors um, with my son sunbathing. Um, while well, the diapers are sunning. Um, and so it kind of brings a tear to my eye to realize that I actually became a stay-at-home mom and um, way differently than we thought would happen. Um, so uh, it, I just wanted to share because it was a huge blessing um, and continues to be a huge blessing to us. And um, the bottom line is that we would still share Young Living even if we didn't earn a paycheck because it has changed our lives so much because it has made such a big impact. And so one of the things they often do um, when uh, you'll hear leaders, leaders talking about this is they'll say, close your eyes and imagine waking up next tomorrow and not having Young Living in your lives. Like, how would that make you feel? To use that enthusiasm to go out and share with others. So I just wanted to share our story and give you guys kind of an idea of like why we are in it. Um, our, our goals continue to change, 
we would still like to have more children naturally. Um, but we would also like to adopt and we recently changed our idea of adopting from, you know, adopting an infant to actually um, probably, uh, hopefully adopting a sibling group. Um, and, you know, moving out into the country and having a big farm and we've actually started writing down very specific goals for these things like um, what kind of, how many rooms we want in our house and, um, you know, kind of yard we want and it, it, those dreams those specific dreams are what actually help you get your goals so I had that very specific dream of becoming a stay-at-home mom and a separate dream of um, quitting my part-time jobs and they both actually converged at the same time to uh, allow me to quit my jobs and become a stay-at-home mom so that's a little bit about my story we're also pushing for gold um, in the hopes that Sam might actually be able to go down to part-time and be able to spend more time with his son who adores him and um, start to become a part-time stay-at-home dad himself um, while we continue to help our team in whatever capacity that we can. So I love what Young Living has done in our lives and we would love to help you guys do the same. So if you've reached the end of this video and you have a specific goal that you would like us to help you achieve, contact me message me, comment on this video, text me, email me, call me, and we will start helping you make that become a reality. You will have to do the work, but I am more than happy to help you brainstorm and come up with ideas and share what worked for us and help you um, see your own dreams become a reality. Thanks for listening, and I hope you guys have a great weekend.